peace. Have it now. Now is the vibrate, of course. Not too far in the future. Not too far in the past. Right now, I know y'all can't really see me. <laughs> it's the words that matter. But uh, it's official right now. It is extremely official. Uh, as far as these energies kicking up to another notch or another level. You know, speaking of the date 2020, you know, like 2020 vision, you know, when the vision get clear, but it's getting to that, you know, that point. You know, I was just on my, my timeline. I saw like, uh, you know, I want to say at least two to three different people, you know, like who went back home, you know, because of uh, somebody transitioning. And, you know, I'm speaking on it now to myself because I'm going home because of, uh, you know, my auntie transitioning. And I'm seeing like, all right, this this is a common thing. Like, you know, there's not no, you know, it's like a synchronicity I'm seeing with this situation. And I know for myself, it's definitely, a, you know, a, a, root, a root chakra, you know, foundation kind of getting rerouted in essence, you know. Uh, and just in essence, just truly too being homesick and vice versa, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, you know, missing some of the people back home, some of the people back home missing me, you know, just the mutual energy on that level. But besides that, again, it's like, you know, it's my, uh, you know, my auntie transitioning, which, you know, uh, She's the one who actually made it happen for me to go out there, you know. Of course, on a human level, you know, I could look at it like, oh, yeah, so-and-so did this and made this happen. So-and-so did this to make that happen. But, like, I actually, you know, talked to her and she was like, like, <laughs> she got this, you know, this little, that, that old school Southern slang. But she was like, no, I got you, old boy. She was like, <laughs> She was like, oh, don't worry about it. I got your ticket. You, you good. You gonna make it there. You know what I'm saying? Like, almost on that, on some, you know, I want you to be the, you know, type of vibes. But the energies is definitely stepping up to that next level, you know. So, you know, now it's time to start, you know, really t taking our spiritual ascension. Uh, I don't like to use the word serious because <laughs> it makes it sound like oh serious and be and be scared because there's nothing to be scared of either. I'm because as I'm bringing this up, this is just again me bringing up a a certain situation or update on the energies and how strong they are right now and this little trend I'm noticing. And again, we're talking about transition. There's no such thing as death. Nobody going nowhere. Matter of fact, just like I said, my auntie was just you know talking to me and let me know if she was gonna make things line up for me to go back to uh, to Louisiana, you know? So, you know, and uh, as I'm thinking about that, you know, we're gonna be going through, matter of fact, I wanna say, uh, which I'll do a video on it, I think the the new moon is gonna be in Virgo, you know, it's an earthy energy, grounding energy, you know, kind of like helping others, you know, organization, you know, but uh, I think about just that, that root chakra, you know, because for most of us, you know, and that's another thing I seen like where the, you know, most of us going back to another place, you know what I'm saying? So we like have to attend, you know, the uh, funeral, you know, uh, back in the, our hometowns, you know, because most of us, you know, somewhere else, you know, so uh, in essence, that's bringing us back to our roots, you know, but the root chakra deals with the, the roots of like your upbringing in essence, you know, your the primary or uh, primal essence of your existence as far as, you know, fight and flight, you know, taking care of yourself. Uh, what else I was gonna say? Something else, anyway. <laughs> It is definitely a, uh, as a matter of fact, that's my, the uh, herb, or the actual act of smoking and not the herb, but anyway, <laughs> but I had to make this video again because I was just on my my phone and 
and saw this trend and I'm like, all right, the energy is definitely stepping to another level. So matter of fact, if some, you know, if some of you may be going through this and you find yourself going back home, and it's another thing too with that situation, you know, ye are God's children of the most high, you know. You no know, matter of fact, is it not written in your law that ye are God? You know, that's one of that's one of Jesus. Jesus said that, you know, quote unquote Jesus, you know. <laughs> that's his name now, quote unquote Jesus. <laughs> but anyway, uh, you know, we we are source experiencing itself you know what i'm saying uh through different perspectives and and also dealing with that situation with being like a quote-unquote empath and sensitive to energy you gotta realize man we're not down here to be you know running from people or being soft or you know like feeling like we are victims when i say soft you know uh like we 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 here to uh and which as i'm saying this of course to each his own on your path and your walk you know however things line up for you but you know in essence you know, we we source experience in itself you know and again it is different perspectives but for sure you know like say for instance we're dealing with family like my 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 ego vibe you know that 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 thought started getting fearful like oh you gonna go back home oh you gonna go backwards as if i'm gonna just go backwards and all my and i and, and then my high self had to squeeze through all that little bull corn and was like bro you tripping it's like you, you know you was going back home and you was on your growth uh before you even came to cali you know you no know, matter of fact doing one of my videos at uh or a few of my videos at my uh at my mom's crib you know but you know, that, that fear, like, of, you know, just probably, and again, that's thoughts, you know, because what it was doing, creating situations that wasn't existing in that moment. In that moment, I wouldn't experience none of those things, you know, but my thoughts was like, you know, uh, just, what if you go backwards, what do you, you know what I'm saying? And like, I'm like, bro, chill out. Or like, what if the energy is just overwhelmed, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, man, look, if I, like, on, Almost like how I feel about dealing with uh, like any oppressing energies or whatever. Like, uh, like Dick Gregory said, you know, if if well, in in that essence, he was like, you know, if they if source or my inner source allow for them to take me out or you know transition me, then God damn it, I deserve it. You know what I'm saying? Like on some, you know, like bro, the sources, you know. Is strong enough within for me to deal with my family or for any and all of us for you know what i'm saying now of course there's different strokes for different folks and different levels you know like uh on on the level of difficulty <laughs> as far as you know us dealing with families where we on a certain level where we just don't want to deal with it or the family on a certain extreme where it's just really hard to deal with them but whatever the case may be you know uh at the same time, you know, again, ye are gods, you know, so we should be able to connect with the family. And, we, and we're dealing with the family. Remember, you know, we're not trying to force no energies on on nobody, you know, just your sheer presence, like holding your vibration, like making sure when you go back home and into these uh, environments, you still meditating and dealing with your crystals and, you know, saying your affirmation, you know what I'm saying? like. You know, deal with yourself like you, like as you should. Uh, but at the same time, you know, uh, again, you don't have to force no words. Like, you know, like how we first get on our growth, we're trying to force everybody to be, uh, or eat healthy. I don't even want to use that phrase. But <laughs> we're trying to get everybody to be healthy. You know, what I meant by phrase, I was going to say vegan or vegetarian. I'm like, we're just healthy. Like, just trying to be healthy. <laughs> you know, but we be on that kick of trying to, you know, like, uh, kick the little knowledge on, you know, healthy foods and stuff like that. And, you know, you should be eating this and you should be eating that. But realize, you know, when we get in that mode, guess what? You know, the ego is always trying to, you know, like it's on that level of right and wrong. Like it is always trying to be right. You know what I'm saying? So if you ever find yourself trying to like win 
Like you feeling like you have something to win in a uh, in a conversation or whatever the case may be, you know, you done stepped into your ego, you know. Like and, and with that, like try or uh, trying to be right again, like you know, like I'm right, V. That's healthy, and you should be doing this. I'm right, you know what I'm saying? It's like nah, you know, you gotta let people, you know, be at their own pace. Like I always bring up with myself, you know. When I was drinking forties and popping Xanax and snorting coke and smoking shrooms and doing all these different things, you know, I'd be damned if I let somebody just walk up to me and be like, "You need to stop that," and I was just gonna stop. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm gonna get out of my face, <laughs> you know? Like, so I, 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 and again on some, you know, on some reflections and how your your older self will come to you. You know what I'm saying? On on, on some type of vibes, you know. Where you know you deal with somebody that's on their level of growth, you, know, you gotta let them be, just like you know, like how you wanted to grow at your own pace, you know. But again, it's your presence. It's like holding your vibration to a certain, you know, uh, to a certain level. You know, remember, like the stronger your light is in your body, you know, the more synchronicities, the more the spirit guides gonna, you know, talk through you and stuff like that. So. You know, the higher your vibration, you don't even have to try to run game. Like, as you're just talking and being yourself, you know, and I know this for, for sure, uh, maybe everybody don't experience it to, to this level, but I know for myself, you know, when, when I find myself, you know, in tune, like, it's just like where I be speaking on stuff. And, and it, it almost, like, people be on some, like, damn, I was just thinking that. Or just, you know what I'm saying? Like, basically, like, being a psychic without being a psychic. Like, you... You're gonna be saying all the right stuff at the right time if you just kind of not try to, you know, fight and, and or try to, you know, uh, force no information on on people. And I say force information, but you know, like of course, you know, share information if the if if, if the situation is presenting itself. But you know, it's not about uh, trying to force anybody to do anything. But in essence, you know, again, that's that's what what's going on, you know, and how I would always bring up like the quote unquote rapture, you know what I'm saying? Which is more than just one thing with with these energies and what what's going on, you know. But it's definitely a, a the 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 raising of the vibration, you know, stepping into a higher dimension of existence, and in that higher dimension, you know lower lower dimensional frequencies you know won't won't be able to you know uh you know to uh, exist on, on on this uh high dimension and that's what we're seeing right now with a lot of people transitioning you know and again they transitioning it's a body suit you know and if you open up your heart and stop you know uh they go this and that well you know what i'm saying like, and, and which that's a whole another story as well, like with, with, with funerals and motives, you know what I'm saying? But some some people just fake crying because they think they have to feel bad about the situation or, you know, like it, it's so much. I, I'm not even going to get into that. Uh, <laughs> that would be another, uh, for another video, but just in general though, going back, you know, home and dealing with, you know, again, like the roots, you know, that, that, that reground and that earth energy, you know, the earth, you know, earth, think about the heart, heart and earth using the same levels of what is the amogram. I'm not, I'm not familiar with the, uh, got the terminology, but, you know, dealing with the fam, it, you know, it shouldn't be nothing that you should be afraid of, you know. Now, of course, again, there's different strokes for different folks on the certain levels of of that situation. But uh, again, we 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 should we should be able to vibe on all levels. Like God, think about how as above, so below. You know, God ne never necessarily left us hanging. You know, whenever we was in our lower vibration frequent, well, us. Whenever we was in our lower vibrational frequencies or whenever we didn't have uh, a lot of the knowledge about spirituality, you know, 
So it's was still throwing us bones and, you know, throwing little crumbs and, you know, leading us in a certain little direction, you know. Whether whether you quote unquote an indigo child or just, you know, however, you know, just generally, you know, so it's, it, it's everything, you know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, so it's, it's the contrast that be kicking our ass to make us, you know what I'm saying, do what we, what we came down to do. So in essence, you know, it's always, you know, it, it's always with us. Source is always with us, no matter what vibration, you know. Of course, you know, uh, the, the, the higher essence of Source may uh, step out of our being whenever we choose to step into a lower vibration. But it is always right there, ready to be, you know, the, as far as the high vibrational essence of source is always ready and right there to be received, you know, within the within the being, you know, because again, source is the quote unquote. That's why it's no good and bad, but source is the quote unquote bad stuff or the resistance that you know that makes you stronger. That pressure, that that pressure that turns you into a diamond as well, you know. So no matter how you slice it, <laughs> you know, it's all source. Know, your, your family, you know. If you can't deal with your family, <laughs> how you gonna be a planet on the next level? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it, you, it's certain things we have to be able to, uh, you know, deal with in essence as we continue to grow spiritually. And, you know, and and whenever you just just put it like this, whenever you find yourself running from anything or feeling fearful about any situation, then that may be something you need to go through or deal with, you know. Of course, you know, assess whether, you know, uh, whether that fear is a legitimate reading on, you know, like, hey, stay away, caution, you know, but well, that's different. But if you're being fearful on some just like creating situations in your head, you know, like all in your thoughts, just being fearful on some what if, what if, what if. And you know, the culprit, there's only one culprit. When it's, when it's in the past or the future, put it like that. Whenever you're outside of the now, you're in your mind. Nine times out of 10. You know, you're thinking about some past events or you, you're worried about what could happen in the future or you, you're anxious about what you're trying to, you know, like you're looking at the future, like I want to manifest this in the future, but you're looking at it from a future aspect instead of doing what you got to do now, you know, but you, you're being your thoughts. Again, back into the, the place with <laughs> dealing with the family, you know, it's all right to vibe, you know, Again, just, you know, keep keep your healthy boundaries, you know. Like I know for me, most of everybody I know in my family, like uh, at this point, I'm, I'm, and I'm pretty sure, you know, for those that don't know, they're gonna learn. <laughs> you know, but I tell people like, no gossip, man. Like when you talk to me, you know, like I don't wanna hear about so-and-so down the street and what happened and, you know, like, cause, it, it don't even uh, necessarily be malicious as much as it just be like, you know, oh, this happened and that, ha you know what I'm saying? You know, it's a country city, you know, uh, slower vibe, you know, again, speaking from my experience, you know. <laughs> but it's like, you know, it's like uh, letting them know like, hey, you know, I don't really deal with that vibe of like, you know, listening about what Shirley around the corner did for like about 40 minutes. <laughs> you know, I'd rather, you know, build on, build on what you've been doing or what I'm doing or, you know, more so in that, in that uh, area. But again, you know, just making sure you set them boundaries. It's all right to, again, source is everything, having fun from the root. So it's go the, the the energy, the Christ energy goes from the root to the crown, you know, is a cycle, the microcosmic orbit, you know. You know, 
sources again from the physical to the to the non-physical all things you know that's that's definitely uh just realizing that these energies is really and matter of fact in essence too you know prepare you know just start becoming uh familiar to not make it sound like no fear monger thing just you know like i always say man uh you know death is an illusion and, and realize you know these are little body suits you know we move through them it's time for us to be in one body suit we transition to another little body suit you know and and sometimes depending on uh you know the, our subconscious vibe you know we may come back in the body suit or we may step to the next level but regardless we're never going anywhere this is the never ending story so you know so you know just just realize those vibes you know and matter of fact and, and with situations like you know like what i'm dealing with you know be, being also that person too you got to be able to hold hold that light in essence you know like when you help and again like uh somebody dealing with you know uh somebody transitioning you know especially when they they feel the vibe of like thinking that it's death and that person really dying like you, you you as a person that's knowledgeable to that situation is not only, you know, uh, you know, in essence, you and your family to a certain extent, you know, of course, you're not, again, trying to forcefully help people if they're not, but, you know, for the ones that you can reach out or that's open to listening to what you got to say, you know, sharing what you, what you know about transitioning and help, you know, ease the, ease the, the quote unquote, well, you know, ease the pain in essence. You know, and let them know also that it's all right to, to uh, you know, it's all right to cry. It's all right to let that energy go. As a matter of fact, I, I always uh, bring that up about, like, with the throat chakra. Like, if you always realize, like, whenever you try to hold your tears back, like, your throat hurt. Reason why? Because you, I'm pretty sure your tear glands may be probably somewhere in your throat. But another reason why is because you're blocking your throat chakra. Crying is a form of expression. You know, your throat chakra deals with expression, you know. And, and if you blocking, you know, your little tears, then, you know, in essence, you you, you blocking expression, you know, and you, you create and block how we talk about clearing chakras and meridians and nadis and stuff like that. You creating a blockage in all your energy zones by, you know, not expressing certain energies, you know. That's why, like, uh, you know, to a certain extent, uh, like with the sexual energies too, where it's like a, how can I say, a thin line with, you know, of course you want to be guard, you know, how can I say, aware of the energies of the people you're dealing with on a sexual level. But at the same time, uh, you know, they kind of bamboozled everybody into being over guarded about it and having sex is taboo when it's you know something that shouldn't be on that level but I digress <laughs> you know but you know again just uh you know maintaining your vibration like being being that 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 vibe again that that, that walking Wi-Fi, you know, because people get downloads again from just being in, in in your auric field, like your 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 higher self, and you know, uh, how can I say, uh, you know, guardian angels, all that, you know, your guides, they they gonna be kind of like, you know, kind of in essence throwing the information in they field, you know what I'm saying? without you having to even say anything. So again, it's not about fussing, telling them they need to stop eating boudin and hog crackling and all that. Psst. You know, it's Louisiana and they pork, you know. <laughs> that swine, eating the swine, brother. <laughs> but anyway, <laughs> you know, again, you know, it, it's being, you know, we, of course, we want to, 
take our uh, our spiritual growth serious in essence, but not serious to where you know you're losing a childlike essence of the whole situation and, and, and becoming like too serious. Because low key, you know, becoming too serious about it is almost getting caught up in the matrix in essence about it, you know. Letting your heart weigh heavier than the uh, letting your heart weigh heavier than the feather. Speaking of transition, <laughs> you know you're in transition from here. You don't want your your heart weighing heavier than the than the feather. You don't want a, your heart feeling like heavy to where it's like, oh man, you know I should have done that, or you know I should have started rapping at an earlier age, or I should have, you know, started. I'm a professional swimmer or I should have, you know, whatever, you know what I'm saying? Like, I shouldn't have did that or, you know. It's like this lifetime right now is to clear all that bullshit. All that shoulda, woulda, coulda could be cleared now. Now is the vibrate. You could clear all the excuses right now. You know, that's what it's about. So when we leave this thing, you know what I'm saying, and we judge ourselves, because it's us judging ourselves, you know, you're going to be like, like, bro, I'm good. Like, I did what I, I mean, on, on, on a vibe where only if you just really, like, love her to that level, you know what I'm saying, where you really want to come back, but, you know, to each his own on <laughs> how we feel about that. Basically, you know, again, you know, uh, just sharing. Because, again, your your life is leading by experience, you know. Like for myself, you know, by, by people, my family and friends seeing that I don't go to the doctor. Like I don't have to go to the doctor, you know. I don't have to... Uh, you know, deal deal with the energies of being sick, you know, like from from the energies like what you get from dealing with uh, you know, unhealthy foods, you know, but it, it don't come from me preaching, it come from them seeing that, all right, the the food eat rabbit food, like they, everybody like the times food eat rabbit food, but you know, seem like he you know, like he healthy, like, you know. Matter of fact, he even Sleeping in conditions that I wouldn't be sleeping in, you look just as healthier than me. You know what I'm saying? Like, and and, and when they see that, you know, it's like that's undeniable. You know, and when we talk about, you know, uh, knowledge, you know, it's knowing. You know, that's knowledge. They know that I eat healthy. You know, and they know what they see. You know, in front of them, you know, they see it. You know. In which we shouldn't always depend on no eyes to, you know. <laughs> but of course, you know, that really solidifies it, you know. Because of course that human nature mostly needs that that confirmation through the five senses. Even to the back to the transitioning situation where, you know, some people may feel like they can't contact their their relative or you know, or friend or you know, that person that transitioned, they feel like they can't contact them, you know, uh, what I was gonna say, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll say, uh, feel like they can't contact them. I was gonna say, oh, I know it had to do with them thinking that they don't have a connection. Oh, bam, I knew what it was, see? Uh, <laughs> like from the five senses, you know, they feel like, you know, a lot of people on that human nature feel like if they can't see, taste, touch, or feel, you know, in some way, form, or fashion, the essence of a, a ghost or, or, you know, or some type of spirit or, you know, just being able to, to deal with it in a five sense manner, like it's not real or they can't tap into that energy, like, oh, they can't talk to me, you know. I want to, you know, I got to see it. And then two, that's how the subconscious work. Like your, your, your conscious mind just saying like, oh yeah, I want to see it, I want to see it. But your subconscious mind is like 
in the back of your head, you're not ready to see that, you know what I'm saying? Even though you claiming that you want to see it. <laughs> so it's that level as well. I'm just trying to, <laughs> not trying to, making sure I'm covering all the little ground that I want to cover. You know, but for sure, just getting on that point too, like dealing with family and you know, not not being scared of that situation. It's, 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 just, it's just the humans that you grew up with. <laughs> not no monsters. <laughs> and I mean, again, you know, uh, everybody's situations is different, you know. But for those of us who, you know, situation align with, you know, with at least being able to, uh, you know, go back around a relative. Cause I know some 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 people's situations may be, uh, you know, too extremely toxic. You know, or it may take a lot of time or whatever the case may be to heal the, the uh, situation. But it's always good, you know what I'm saying? Cause as much as, you know, it's cool with the, you know, having our soul tribes and making sure, you know, we, and I say making sure, but, you know, connecting with with our, our soul family, but at the same time, you know, again, God, God is from the crown chakra to the root chakra, you know, matter of fact, he, to the earth star chakra, to the interstellar gateway, you know what I'm saying? like. You know, so from the highest of high to the lowest of low, you know, so no matter what part of that existence, you know, it's, it's connecting on, again, like, uh, of course, we want to protect our vibrations and make sure we're not around lower vibrations to a level, but then that's where, about, you know, talk, speaking up and creating boundaries. Matter of fact, uh, using the throat chakra stones, uh, satellite, uh, septarian, you know, good for speaking up, speaking the truth. Lapis Azuli, you know, speaking the truth, how you feel, you know, because, cause too, a lot of us dealing with a situation where, you know, we change, we, you know, we changed, and, and a lot of people haven't seen us since we changed. Like, you know, last time they saw us, they saw us like in the old, you know, in the old format, you know. Matter of fact, just like a computer in a program, the old software and format, you know, that's that's what they're familiar with, and they may have that approach to, you know, dealing with us in that same format. You got to speak up and set that boundary, like, oh no, no, I don't uh, do, you know, deal with that no more. I don't do this no more, you know, or whatever the case may be. <laughs> That's basically it, you know. Just 2020 coming, you know, the vision. <laughs> Keeping it clear. Peace out.